Hi people, um, how are you today? Uh, Magic Mouse 2, not working. <laughs> um, I've had this put away for 12 months and I decided to have a go at it. I, there wasn't, hadn't been much on the web, uh, on YouTube about it or, so i done some research and through the Mac specifications, had a look at what it looked like inside, see if I could attempt to do it. And so what we got, it's easy to pull apart, so I'll show you how. We'll just get straight into it. I'm not going to waste time on this. So just get a um, screwdriver, flat screwdriver, and and let's flip it, let's turn it like that. And go around. You can't break anything, so don't worry. It's not like the old mouse where it had a harness that could be pulled out very easy and if you're not tech savvy you could damage it okay so that's the inside of a magic mouse I'll just make sure you can see that sure I've got it good enough uh, so as you can see there got the harness and oh, I'm trying to hold it with one handy and hold the camera with the other. Um, so the battery, battery can't be taken out, I've tried and I've done some research, it's actually glued in. Uh, so they used to take, if you wanted to get deeper into the, uh, say, optical lens part, if you wanted to get to that, um, everything above, below this is all glued together as Mac does. They don't want you to fix it, they want you to go and buy a new one, you know that. So there are all the sensor things for, for scrolling and that sideways, up and down, and uh, your harness, if I can go on, I'll just see if I can get a better um, picture on that. I uh, uh, just need to get a better picture on there. I want you to see what it looks like. Go back a bit. Away from the lens. It's got, it, it's got steel clips, or aluminium clips, I think they are. Or titanium, whatever. Alumi no, it'll be aluminium. Whatever they are, anyhow, they hold the harness in. This thing, before, it used to be just pushed in there and you open it up and it pop out and could confuse a lot of people and it could be hard to get back in. So I've checked everything else. You uh, need a technician to do the rest. Uh, and a technician wouldn't be watching this video. So I'm just like, so I know the normal people will be watching this. Uh, apparently the battery is very strong. Um, if it goes flat, only takes five minutes to give it a, uh, a zap, which would last two days. But I think it takes about 12 hours to charge it right up, I'm not sure, something like that. But if, it, if you get two days, you know, to get a month's worth out of it, you need to just put it on overnight. And uh, the, the, the um, Bluetooth section will show you how charge the battery is. So that's it. Now mine would I just if I can go back down how I take and look like down there. I go down I want to put it back down. I want to be able to do things. See if I can get a better picture on that. Okay. 
mine was full of dust. All inside there, I lived in a house, the last place was very thick carpet, near the ocean, a lot of the wind, a lot of dust, always in the house. This area here was full of dust all around there was covered. So that little antenna thing was uh, not received, uh, was covered in dust. Uh, to get into the internal parts, if you're full of dust there, you'll need a penetrating oil like WD-40 and then just let it dry out. Uh, don't use any water for God's sake inside there. If you use water, yeah, that's the end of it. So, um, you can spray a, a bit of um, degreasing oil if you've got some of that. that. That's like penetrating oil and just go around the edges and clean any dust that's hanging around and uh, yeah, just give it a makeover and pen it out uh, the grease which you can buy pretty cheap from uh, any store these days just clean everything the greaser won't hurt it because it's got no water it's an oil base and 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 uh, dries out. So just clean it all up, and I sh we'll go now over to the computer and we'll try it out. Put it back together. Just show you that bit. Bang! Just clip back together like that. Okay. Well, Okay, so we're now uh, over to the Mac. Now, there's our, so click on, go to Existence Preferences down the bottom and just click on Bluetooth, click on Bluetooth. Okay, so Magic Mouse 2 not connected. Let's connect, see what happens, and turn it on. Connected, okay. And I've got the battery thing there. I've, uh, just, I haven't been able to get that for 12 months. Uh, it found itself straight away. Then I uh, don't know what all that. We go to mouse. And we might just speed that up a bit. Okay. So there's the mouse battery level, 100%. Haven't had that for over a year. So, it, so obviously the dirt was stopping the signal. Now let's get this out of the way. Just to be able to scroll with your finger. How great is that? Now, so there you are on display and she's working again. So that's how you fix it. It's just dust. I hope I've helped you and I hope I've saved you 99 bucks or whatever they cost in your neck of the woods. And I hope I've helped you. Bye-bye.